Hi, I wanted to share this experiment that I was doing uh, with antennas uh, to see the over-the-air stations that I would get. And I've made several uh, antennas that eh, work just okay. But this one got in 80 stations in my local area. I'm in California. And I uh, just wanted to share this with you, uh, what I came up with. Now on here, might not be able to see. Gets dark back here. These are about eight inches long. They're just V's. They're all connected. Uh, the bottom one's connected um, from the bottom to the top. And it goes into the goes into a matcher. And then from there a cable to the um, OTA of the TV. Uh, these here, this is off an FM antenna that I removed just because these will bend uh, up and down. Those will bend up and down and to get uh, more uh, reception or whatever station you're trying to get, you may have to uh, twist those up, down, different directions. And um, let's see, from the top here, these top singles, these were a V, these were a V, but then I took the uh, top, bent it up and connected to the adjustable, to the adjustable um, bendable rods on both, both top ones. And then these are connected all the way up that go into the uh, matching transformer. Well, I say I get um, 80 channels. Yeah, some of them aren't wa watchable. Some are kind of pixelated uh, because, but um, pixelated because of the reception. But I'd get much better if I would put this antenna outside. But the pictures are really clear. And some of the older stations, like you'll get the old game shows. Like there's Cozy TV that plays a lot of the old TV shows from back in the 60s and 70s. And there's Me TV, This TV, THIS. Um, many stations. But anyways, I just wanted to share that with you and let you know how many stations it get. And it would be much better if you put it outside probably. And this is hanging on the wall inside. So thanks for watching.